Bangara! <laughs> yes! The Bangarang big like the pumpkin here. Bangarang! Bangarang are 99, you know. 99 Mountain View Avenue. Auntie Dana, I love your composure. I really love your composure yesterday. Honestly, credit to you, Auntie Dana. Credit to you. May I tell you, me watch you. Me watch you and watch the, the, all the saga unfolding yesterday. Bangarang! Yes, guys. Kachi Hatalai. Anyway, guys, anyway, um, in all seriousness, what took place, the saga that unfolded at 99 yesterday, you know, was something to behold. Because I was watching Auntie Nana on Facebook, and all I could see was this woman's shoes. And I'm thinking, you know, this woman just turned up that she come from America and, you know, that, that she want place to sleep. And my auntie then I say, no, not your son, no room. No room at the inn. No room at the inn. You can't take your stranger into your place. So, yes, even I became um, suspicious. So, in all seriousness, I, I, um, I must say big up to auntie Donna. I like your composure. I like that you did not you know burst out in any big um boisterous uh, uh um arguing with this person and to run out from your yard and you kept your composure and you were right to call the police because if you don't know then you seek advice and basically that's what happened and i watched the whole thing and i thought to myself you know what in these days, one has to be very cautious. And you kept your composure, Auntie Donna. You really kept your composure. So, and I must big up that lady, Charmaine, who called and to make everything clarified with regards to the lady. And, you know, apparently what I think it turned out to be that the woman had nothing, you know, um, ill towards Auntie Donna and it wasn't a setup but auntie dana had to be um cautious because you know a lot of insinuation a lot of thought was going on and thinking who set up auntie dana because she felt that way because of um the fact that she has announced that she has her green card and she'll be doing a greet and meet but yes i i must say well done to your auntie dana may watch it from another from from a dana to another dana Kachi hatalai I doff my come on. I doff my hat to you. You never argue and, and, and carry on. You never put up none of your liquor. You know, you know, you know you, you can't go <laughs> ready if it's say. Because of you know the, I mean uh, it was funny in a sense where this woman just turned up, but it's in all seriousness, guys. We have to be cautious. The Auntie Donna, the people who works at your place needs to be more um uh What's the word may I look for now? They need to be more um they don't have a motion we can't get up. But anyway, they need to be more cautious and you know check their surrounding and just don't allow any anyone to, to just walk in. You know, I watched it and I I, I thought to myself, my God, mm. but then you know these things happen. You have if you if 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 people are treating you badly in a way, you know, saying ill things and all that it's very disheartening you know very disheartening that everything that she does because me i watch her down a market to buy the lime i messed to myself say the amount of lime me have in my yard of jamaica me glad say me have lime tree soaring tree all kind of trees so you know me i watch her down a market and she said she tired and she all the money was she have she, she done all of the money because she couldn't um bless so on um, people me i watch and then for see she come from market and for come book up in a disa uh, you know so when the police came they did they were quite you know professional and they did not disclose anything but when the lady came on and said there's one lady who said to press charge press charge press charge sometimes you have to be careful you know because the constitution is um, you were um god on time as um i said buchanan the constitution and the rights of people it's you have to know your rights because she could have a press charge and it turned out to be nasty than what people think because just pressing charge saying press charge press charge it's not easy because everything has to go through the um procedure and procedures in jamaica take long look what you know look how long these cases take so guys let's 
give a big hand to Auntie Donna for keeping her composure. You know, someone just turned up on her doorstep and, you know, wanting to sleep at our house. Uh, a lot of people um, are obsessed and, you know, she has fans. But yes, we are here and everybody watch where we have to watch and do what we have to do. We have our part and I, and I, my contribution is, is that um, I even voted, you know, guys. I voted. I voted. I was one of them who voted to say yes. It seemed like it's a setup because it just never seemed right. But then, as I said, when the um the lady came on the um the, the policewoman said that um she's mentally um not. I uh, mean, be careful, Mr. Pioneer, but yeah, the woman um is not well put it that way allegedly uh let me use that word just in case then come for me but mental illness is a big thing and one must take that into consideration and don't laugh at it you know don't laugh at it we can laugh at how it started but in the end we have to be serious and realize that anything any one of us it can happen to any one of us because you know you just get up today and you have so much things on your brain and your mind and you are worried about this you are worried about that and you just get up and you do things because your brain now function and you're not focusing and this is what mental health does to you so guys be vigilant these guys at antidona need to be vigilant and check your surrounding also do not put anyone down because of their um their illness because it can happen to any one of us a lot of us are carrying baggages a lot of us are internalizing a lot of us have things in here and sometimes you find an avenue to just let it out and that woman just feel like she must um go to auntie dana place you understand me but because auntie dana she has to be cautious so she did the right thing call the police you know she didn't take any uh, and you know what i like as well when Auntie Donna gave her the bag, a River Island bag that she's never used. What a nice gesture. That was a nice gesture, Auntie Donna. Because the lady said she have a small bag in there. And then she took the bag, you know, and then she turned away. I mean, I said to myself, say, isn't she going to say thank you? But the lady turned around, you know, and said, thanks, Planka. And I thought that was really nice of her as well. So even we voted. So, guys, be, try and look after your mental wellness your health your strength you know it's disheartening when you see people are ill it's disheartening when people this bad mind grudgefulness that you are an edge you depend edge so any little thing you think to say somebody has set you up you understand me and all of those kind of things so guys be careful just pray just ask god to guide and protect because we know that we are on earth here and anything is possible so big up to auntie donna congratulations on getting your visa to america and i wish you blessings guidance protection god washes blood over you that you can go to and not never happen to you but you have to be cautious you have to be vigilant you have to be aware be aware and that's exactly what she exercised yesterday she was most aware she looked around her surrounding and realized that who was send this a woman come for come try to come set her up now to make she go get boisterous and then say in America, look how the woman chase the woman from here, so and all of that. You know what? We are humans and we Jamaicans, we just, you know, drama is the, the, the game of the day. But I am so glad in the end it worked out and the lady is okay. And the police woman, Charmaine, me like her attitude. She fair square and she just talked the truth. So, and then I said, press charge, press charge. But Auntie Dana wasn't quite sure. She was kind of, you know, thinking, should I, should I not? And I was just thinking, it don't make no sense because it's going to be long and drawn out. It's going to be a long, drawn out case. So, Auntie Dana, this flower, this orchid is for you. This big Sunday morning, just praise God and well done for being very composed and very, very astute in yourself and thinking, well, God cover you. And you did the right thing. So I'm glad it worked out. So guys, have a pumpkin on me. Bangarang! Kachi Atalai. Yes, Kachi Atalai. Guys, I'm 60, fabulous, and I don't care. Well done to you, Auntie Donna. Take care. Lots of love. I wish you all the best anyway. You know, there's always, and I'm, listen, Auntie Donna, love you. From a Donna to another Donna, well done. Well done. Go bake your pudding, them Auntie Donna. 
Thank you so much. Love, lots of love. Take care.